Yenga electricity and magnetism makes it easy to investigate electromagnetic effects like induction. Drag the fixed circuit induction setup to the stage and see a current generated in the coiled wire when you drag the magnet back and forth. You can double click on the coil to change the number of turns in the coil diameter. Just like a moving magnet in a coil, you can move a wire in a magnetic field. Just drag up and down on the black handles to move the wire and you'll see current flow. To use these effects to generate a usable current, use the generator. To turn it, move the rotor towards the generator and it'll snap into place. To test it out, drag the filament lamp to the stage. Double click on the lamp to adjust its power rating or on the generator to change the field strength or direction. Click the yellow terminal of the generator and then move your mouse to one of the bulb's terminals. A wire will be drawn. Do the same for the generator's black terminal. Turn the rotor by dragging the handle or double click on it to set a constant rotation speed. The lamp will explode if the current gets too high, but you can fix this by clicking on the spanner symbol that appears. If you want to keep an eye on how much current is passing through the lamp, or monitor any other property in your simulation, drag a property tag from the measurement folder onto the object you want to measure. Double click on it to select the property you want to observe and the units in which it's measured. To get an idea of how a transformer works, drag the experimental transformer between them and wire the components together. By dragging from terminal to terminal, wires are created automatically. You can set the rotor to turn a set number of rotations per minute by double-clicking and changing the value, but the current generated may be too high for the lamp. To fix this, Double-click on the transformer to adjust the number of turns on each side and step down the current to a suitable value for the lamp. Now, when you repair the lamp, it glows brightly. If you want to look at a value over time, you can drag a graph from the presentation folder onto the stage. Connect the graph to the lamp and select the property you want to monitor. This graph lets you track the progress of individual properties like current or voltage.